Hi guys, welcome to another video. In this video we are installing and configuring our environment to develop uh, basic web applications at the first time accessing to the Visual Studio Code uh, official site. We start with the download of the installer and after the download finish we start with the installation of the Visual Studio Code ID. In the Visual Studio Code installation we accept the agreement of or of the listen agreements and we have all the options by default and we choose the install and when we finish the installation we start opening the visual studio code environment and we have a welcome page we have in the top all the menus to control this this tool we have some uh, access that are important in our environment we have the explorer and uh, the search the source code run and extensions and we have in, in the bottom the manage to control all the settings related to this uh, application we're going to change a little bit the zoom now to continue with the configuration of this uh, application we access to the extensions to download some important extensions to work with the html and css now we are starting searching the html extensions we install the html css support html snippets intellisense for css class names in html we install the html hint extension and we need to look now for the css we install the beautify css and the next we need to look for the intellicode of visual studio and finally the live server and the live server preview all of these tools are uh, important to install these extensions to improve our visual studio code application and we have an example about how to use and implement and construct of course a web an easy web application we have to start creating and opening a folder for our project in this case is a web application once the application restart we can create uh, different files for example the the home that it's an html and we can construct the, the design in a CSS file. The extensions that we download at the beginning of this exercise give us the opportunity to construct different parts of your code in an easy way. For example, we just type the docked word and that give you all the structure of an html document we have the html tags the head tags and the body tags by default we can change different parts of your code but you have the option to look your change in the open with live server option 
the access to to this part if we create some message example hello hello world and we save this part we change this uh, message in the in in the web browser we have other option we we can show the live server preview and this preview is inside of our Visual Studio Code application and you don't need to change between windows and you just change in this case your code and all the changes after you save the document or documents they apply in, in the right side for example we have in this part some code that we change and after we save the document the change is applied in this side and of course this applied to the CSS or the design tool in this case we need to link the CSS files we need to use the link CSS abbreviation and you only change the name of your uh, CSS file. We save the document and now we change, for example, the text that we create, the color of this text to blue, for example. And when we change, this text change to, and of course, to the first element, we can change the color, for example to to red we save and all the changes that we apply to these elements occur after you save the documents and that's it guys see you in the next video